Hello, Bits and Eddies, and welcome to a very special episode of Quiet Speed. Today, we're going to be talking very quietly. Uh, thanks for joining us today. I'm your host, Blake. And, uh, we're going we're gonna to get right into the game. Okay, here we go. So, um, I'm not going to be that quiet, but I am going to be, like, generally a little bit quieter. It's getting late. There are people sleeping. So, uh, I probably shouldn't be talking very loud. So that being said, uh, it's time for me to go to the next area, which, for my case, will be Abyss Watchers. And I'm going to be headed into, um, the Karthus Catacombs. I'm going to take a sip to start us off today. Because I need a bit of that energy. Uh, I've been cooling down a little bit for, about, for a while. Um... Because I, I beat the Abyss Watchers, and I helped Nathan uh, work on his surprise build that he's going to do. Uh, it's, a, it's a big surprise for you guys. Uh, saving it for the finale. Don't know why I was hear, hearing banging upstairs. Um, okay. Well, I'm not going to question the banging going on. Instead, I'm just going to do a little bit of this. Screw you, in particular. So I really don't like you. Oh. Alright. So in case you don't know, Karthus Catacombs are one of the three areas in this game that I really hate. Uh, and there's a reason for that. It's because of these, these skeletons right here. This guy right here. He's such a pain. And now he's gonna get back up, which does not help, let me tell you. Doesn't help me, anyway. Crap. 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 Crap on a cracker. Alright. If I die here, I'm just gonna go straight into doing this the quick, cheesy way. Which I might do anyway. Uh, just because it looks like I'm probably going to die here, and I don't want to deal with that. Okay, well he's down. He's the only real threat, so... Shotgun blast. Shotgun blast. There you go, you're down. Alright. So, knowing that there's just more of those guys in that door at the end of the hallway, it's time for us to uh, commit suicide. Here we go. Whee! I'm kidding, of course. We're not going to kill ourselves. That'd be a terrible idea. However, we are going to kill this skeleton because he's kind of a dick. I'm going to kill him in the most humiliating way possible, too. I'm just going to kick him off a ledge. And then I'm going to immediately fall off the ledge myself. I am an idiot. I'm going to kill him in the most humiliating way possible, I say, as I do the exact same thing to me. My own goddamn self. Ah, this has started off well. Okay, we're not bothering with these guys this time. We're going to run right past them. And we're going to go. Alright, is everybody cool with that? I hope you're all cool with that. Because I usually don't run past enemies. But honestly, the first section of this place is just a nightmare. There's skeletons that keep coming back from the dead. Guys who are freaking actually competent fighters. There's freaking parry kings. There's um, soul dregs. There's basically everything you can possibly hate in a game is right in this area. Everything you can possibly hate in this game is right here. Pyromancy Tome, which I don't think I'll need, but, um, hey, I might. It's possible. I actually don't know where I am, to be entirely honest. But I'll take that. Um, I don't know where I'm going. Ow, you prick. 
I didn't know you could do that. I didn't know you could strike that high. Um, alright. Really? I guess he is exact is pretty thin. Doesn't exactly have a lot of uh, body weight to him. Don't mind me, I'm just trying to make the game take itself out. And it's not exactly working. Alright, so where am I now? Um, okay, I'm above where I want to be, actually. I'm even higher up than I was originally. Wonderful. Yeah, I'm not dealing with you. You're a parry king. I don't know why a headless, one-armed skeleton is a parry king, but I mean, you know, whatever. Great, right? Totally fair. Totally fair. Well, my excuse for running through this area rather than actually fighting everything like I'm supposed to, uh, in this case, is going to be, well, I did say I was going to speedrun it. Even though I have, in every other way, failed to speedrun it, and therefore that excuse is entirely invalid. Okay, you can screw off, honestly, in sincere honesty. You can just go fuck yourself. Ow. You gotta be a dick about it, though. Okay, I'll take some of those heals. Hmm. Alright. So I need to figure out how to get down there. I guess I have to go back up. And then run back down. So I guess that's what I'm doing. Hey-o! Welcome to fuck me, right? I have to know these guys are weak to fire, so my pyromancy should be effective against them. Alright, here we go. So, I don't want to deal with that guy. I'm going to run down these stairs, and there's going to be a giant ball, which comes to kill me. But instead of killing me, I'm going to move off to the side and let it kill them. Or, you know, at least heavily damage them. So that they're easier to kill. Ow, okay, well... So, so much for instead of killing me, apparently I just made it in, in addition to. Great. Welcome to the calmest episode of this show yet. Uh, where, rather than pure rage, I simply slip into, um, mild discomfort and passive-aggressive hatred comments. Uh, no, is my response to that. Oh, well, okay. Alright, well, I guess that didn't work, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna say fuck this, right? Ding. Oh, great, I have killed myself. It would appear I have killed myself. Wonderful. I should probably actually jump off of that ledge, right? Not just roll. You'd think I would know that. I pulled it off the first time perfectly fine. Oh, okay. Let's just get up from the bonfire twice. Don't mind that. Um, hmm. 
Alright. Whatever. Not important. Let's just go. Because honestly, screw this. I need to pick those up, even though there's literally zero souls there. Might as well take them anyway, right? Hey yo, suicide time. Don't follow me. Ah, you prick. Well, guess what I'm running from. Well, well, nice try. I don't know where I am. Ow. I appreciate not that though. Ow, damn. Oh, here we go. This is where I want to be. I mean, that's not what I want to be dealing with. This is the area I want to be in, anyway. You just stand off on the edge here. Oh. I thought it hit me for a second, but that wasn't that. That was some stupid skeleton. Bye-bye. Okay, so... We are going to do the unthinkable and, uh, say, screw this entire area. Because, honestly, screw this entire area. We're, we're running past this area, honestly. Hey, yo. Oh, god damn it. Soul drags. Soul drags. Soul drags. These are the things that I hate. I mean, everything in this area are the things that I hate. But still. Uh, what's that item? Probably nothing worth fighting these dudes for. Let me just take that real quick, and then get the hell out of here. Run, run, run. Oh, hello, bonfire. I might have to turn around and face those guys. Hope not. Heyo, we are here. Good, we reset the bonfire. So, we're doing alright. So far. Alright, so now I should be able to set my sign down. I mean, I, I, I probably could have said it. Oh, that's right, I'm offline. So, the servers went offline, and now I'm playing alone, which means no Nathan to help me, unfortunately. It also means no using other people to scout out the area before going in, um, but that's okay because I remember this area very well, because I spent a lot of time here thanks to the on request, because uh, I, I did that whole thing. We have to kill Horus in order to stop him from killing her. It took me a while to figure out what I was supposed to do with that, so inevitably, uh, I did that. Hi, buddy. How are you? Well, you know, of course you would. Of course you would do that. I don't have a shield to block those, so that's wonderful. You're done. Nice try. You had me you had me running there a bit, but nice try. Unfortunately, I'm a bit better than you. Sorry, buddy. Oop, 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 oop. There we go. That's what I wanted. Hi there, buddy. Oh no! I appear to have died. That's death. Um, I blame the fire gem. Clearly it was the fire gem's fault. It wasn't at all my own stupidity. And my tendency to press buttons way too many times. Definitely not. No, it was the fire gem, for sure. I hear you. Where are you going? You're going that way today, huh? Alright, I'll follow you. But not too far. Hey, how's it going? Don't mind me, I'm Sephiroth. I, I feel like his eyes should have been a little bit more blue. But honestly, I feel like I did make his eyes a little bit more blue. I think the game just kind of decided, nah, we don't want his eyes to be blue. I made them like a, a crystallish blue. But I don't see any blue in them. They look just white. Or just gray. Which, I mean, it was supposed to be a grayish blue, but not just gray. Okay, you can you can screw yourself. I'm I'm done with you, quite frankly. 
I'm indifferent to your state of mind. Whatever you choose to do with yourself is your own problem. Because as long as you stay away from me. I mean, if I'm honest, I would prefer you to go screw yourself. Because that is what would suit me best. You having to do this constant dodge, which the result of which is, of course, I never get any decent attack combos in. I'm gonna go for the attack this time. There we go, see? I just had to go in for the attack. So this game has not yet become my living hell like, um, like Meat Boy was, but I imagine that will eventually happen with this one as well. Hey, yo. All right, cool. I didn't do one too many attacks that time. So I managed to push him off. Nope. Let us pull that lever. Uh... Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. There's an invasion there, but I don't have to deal with it because I have, um, what do you call it? All right, now that all the Skelebros fell down, um, I'm going to take on the boss. He shouldn't be hard. I, well, you know what? I'm not going to take on the boss yet. Um, do I have an option really, though? Because... I don't think I can go back. I can't go back. I guess I have to. Well, luckily it will be easier to get here next time. Because I opened the door. I shouldn't have crossed the thing prematurely. That's fine, though. So this is a perfectly ordinary and safe-looking goblet, right? Let's drink out of this. Let's do some uh, Last Crusade here going on. Oh, that's terrifying. Hmm, I wonder what this darkness is. Is there an item over there? Well, let's go pick that up. Oh, wonderful. So, this is another one of the easiest bosses in this game, so I should be able to beat it first try, maybe second. Then again, uh, I also called for it one of the easiest bosses, and then of course I got my ass handed to me a few times. So who knows? Hey, maybe it'll be first try, maybe it'll be 30th try, who knows? Oh god damn it, really? You're gonna hit me with that, that lame bullshit? Yeah, um, I'd definitely be able to beat this first try if I had all of my Estus Flasks, but I had to waste a couple getting here, and I can't go back, so there's that. So he's gonna spawn some Skelebros, but they are easy to beat. Um, I don't know if you saw that, but I just received an invitation from which is, uh, Nathan. Actually, uh, bleep out his username, because it's actually not his username. It's his friends. But, uh, yeah. I just received an invitation, but, so he's, he's ready to play again, but I'm going to finish this first because I can, because it shouldn't be all that difficult, because honestly, these, this dude, um, all it is is, uh, you just break his wrist bands, you just break his fancy, uh, fancy entrance bands to, uh, his, uh, his Six Flags entrance bands, and then, uh, and then he can't enter Six Flags anymore, so he, he dies, because he's sad. Because Six Flags is a really cool place, not sponsored by Six Flags. That's just the truth. It's just a cool place. 
I don't get to go there nearly as much as I would like to, but it is a cool place. I'm not lying with that in that regard. I really wish you would stop um, being right here. I wish you would back up a little bit. Hey, oh, there goes two. I'm gonna heal up because he's probably gonna do something stupid. Oh, you, you prick. Really? You're gonna be here? Alright, let's go for that third band. Uh, I don't know what he's doing, but I don't particularly like it. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, great. Um, oh, I have no idea how I died there. <laughs> But whatever. Yo, it's good. Uh, okay, everything so... and nothing at the same time. Lovely. Uh, I'm going to try um, cosplaying as Cloud. Some what? Oh, cool. I'm gonna have to bleep that out. Oh. Oh, I didn't know that you were right in the middle of your episode. I am. I'm gonna kill High, Wol High Lord Wolnir. I'm in the middle of an episode of Quiet Souls, where I, I'm being quiet, because I'm tired, <laughs> and it's late. Oh. Let me just kill High Lord, High Lord Wolnir, because he's not even that tough. In fact, he's kind of one of the weakest dudes. Yeah, like, if you know how to deal with him... Honestly. Yeah, if you know his obvious weak point that glows in the frickin' dark, uh, yep. then, yeah, he's kinda easy. Bye bye buddy. It's like fucking log in already. He killed me on the first try, but that's because, um, <laughs> I went in with less than my full things, because I had to fight that annoying skeleton in the hallway. Yeah, we're gonna skip this cutscene. It's not that interesting. Um... Yeah, I almost killed him on the first try, even though I had less than my, um, you know... Yeah. Estus Flasks. He's winding up for an attack, and dodge. Yeah, so, um, this version that you're playing and that I'm playing right now is version 1.13. version 1.14 comes out, that's when the Aquamarine guy gets those buffs. Oh, that nice. That also means the Ring Knight paired greatswords are getting buffs. Uh, what greatswords are getting buffs? Server. Uh, Ring Knight paired greatswords. Fanny bullshit that I fucking hate. Anyways. Yeah, it's a pain in the ass. But, um... Yeah, I'm not able to join the servers for some reason. I've yet to actually so, take a hit from this dude. Yeah, he's... Hello. And... I've almost yeah. broken two gauntlets already. Two things. Yeah, so welcome to the no-hit Wolnir run. I mean, I haven't I, beaten him yet, but I'm two-thirds of the way through, and I haven't taken a hit. No, yeah, it's, it's not. I say as I immediately take a hit, of course. I need to stop bragging. You didn't <laughs> yeah, see nothing. That didn't happen. See, I'm still at full health. In fact, I have more health than I came in here with. I don't know what you're talking about. Success to flasks? I've always had five. What are you doing? Well, near, what the fuck are you doing? Why do you just keep doing that attack? Just keep doing the same attack. Is it called Cornix's Leggings? Uh, I don't know. It's part of the Cornix set. Just look up the Cornix set. Shit. His, um... He has positioned himself in such a way that his mist hits the entire map now. Uh-huh. So, I better kill him before he does that again, or I'm dead. He's pulling a sword out of the ground. Oh, yeah, that's fine. 
That's how he killed me last time. Yep. Oh, hello. Hello, arm. Farewell. God damn it. Will you just put your arm where I can kill you? It's gonna happen. Quit fighting it. Oh, okay. He's doing attacks I've never seen him do before, because usually we kill him before he does this. Amy, what art thou doing? Stop pulling the sword out of the ground. You've done it twice already. Alright, you can go fuck yourself, in all honesty. God damn it, I can't hit him. He won't put his band down. He's doing the breath thing again, which means I'm screwed. Mm. Oh. Yeah, apparently if you go too far behind him, you die too. Yes. Like, mm. automatically. Without warning. Yes, I knew that. Yes, I, I did not. That. I did not know that. I did. I, I knew that. You could have told me. Right. Um, if you go too far into the dark, you die. Because it's the abyss, and the abyss we can. Oh. Good to know. Thanks for telling me, Nathan. You're welcome. I'm gonna kill this dude. I'm gonna kill this dude myself. Good idea. Wait, so let's see. Where... Where... I'm just gonna run there. I've fought you guys plenty of times. I don't need to fight you again. Yeah, those faggots. I don't need to fight rats another time to get there. It's not like I'm running away from a challenge. The rats are not a challenge. I think, um... Patches armor set works for this. Oh yeah, I forgot to kill Patches. Yeah, yeah. Not a big deal. Hey, do you ever have to come back to the catacombs ever again? Carthus catacombs? Yeah. Catacombs of Carthus? Carthus yeah. catacombs? The Carthus catacombs. Uh... The catacombs of Carthus. The Carthus where the catacombs are. Who's goes poison? I don't know. Where did he move? Is he doing the breath thing? What's he doing? Yeah, he's doing the breath thing. Alright, I'm moving back. I think cover is an extremely large area. Seriously? Yes, Carson. Oh shit, you're gonna have to bleep out all of that, aren't you? You are. Oh, I don't want I just saved my own ass very barely. <laughs> he has climbed basically up to the top, and he was about to do the breath thing, and then I frickin' yeah. God damn it! Did he get you? Yeah, because he climbed up further. I was about to attack his hand, and then suddenly he climbs up further, and I die because I'm behind him. That's such bullshit. The fact that he can, like, shrink the map without warning 
and like it's not a wall that comes in it's sudden death that comes in without warning no warning why would we tell you that's, that's his gimmick he's a fucking dick he's a dick you hear me It's a lame gimmick. Eh. He's a lame boss fight. He is. He's a shitty boss. So much for tough but fair, right? Mm. More like... I'm going with this. I have Alright, he goes late stage. I'm going to start throwing fire magic at him. Okay. He, is, he does count as a skeleton, so he is weak to fire. Yeah, I know. I just don't want to waste it all right off the start when I can easily hit his arms. That's it's the late part when he starts to, like, prevent me from hitting his arms. That's when it gets difficult. Because, like, the early part, he just keeps his arms right down on the ground where you can just whack at him. Okay, I didn't know where his arm was. Apparently, he was above me, descending at a rapid rate. And he's breathing. What are you doing? What are you doing, Molnir? You freaking gimmick. You freaking gimmick of a boss. What are you doing? Spawning some shit. You spawning some shit, Molnir? He literally spawns some shit and then immediately kills it by moving forward. Saw that coming. Last second. One bracelet down. Okay, you can screw off. Because honestly, I'm done with you. Well, guess what? Your bracelets are ugly. Stupid bracelets. Try something wrong. Trying to insult him, I figure it might help, right? He's gonna slam his hand down. It's gonna do literally nothing, because he's just gonna spawn some more skeletons that he's just gonna kill himself anyway. Especially now that I pissed him off, now he's gonna start doing sweeping attacks, which is just gonna kill those skeletons faster. Oh, whoa, what the heck? One of those rolly skeletons? Where the hell do these guys come yep. from? I'm going to get to the farthest corner I can possibly get to and hope that the mist doesn't get me. Oh, wow. It barely missed me. Oh, okay. That's good. That's a good thing that's happening. Stuck inside of his hand. Okay. Not going to question that. What's he doing? Okay. Stop with the freaking magical swords, please. Oof. 
I'll take shit that's I'll take shit that's not a threat for ten. for him to put his hand down for once. He never does, that's the thing. He never puts his hand down. There it is, it's down. Come on, frickin' let, frickin' die. Back into the abyss with you. Whoo! Whoo wee mama! Yeah, remind me never to drink from any skull goblets. Just gonna keep, just gonna keep smoking, huh? All right, whatever. <laughs> All right, so I guess that's the end of this episode. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm gonna go level. And I'll be back with my favorite area in just a second. Well, second favorite area after one of the DLC areas. Uh, yeah, so I'll be back with that tomorrow. And until, or next week, I should say. And until then, stay interesting.